get them! Go! Go! <laughs> goes with the territory. Let's get the hell out of here. Damn it. Come on. <laughs> Going somewhere? Hey, Eddie. Did you really think you could escape from what? Oh, no. I just giving the young lady the $10 tour. Shut it. I bet you're working for them, too. What? You thought you could set me up and keep everything for yourselves, hmm? Get down! Damn it! This guy's crazy! Eddie, take it easy, buddy. <laughs> well, you're out of luck now! And out of road. Now, give me that map. Hold on. All right, you got me, fair and square. Hey, don't move. Relax, Eddie. Just get in the map like you asked. I said, hold on. I am. Well, hand it over. Well, now, you told me not to move. Looks like you're gonna have to come get it. Uh, come God's sake! Oh, these guys never quit! <sighs> this was a big mistake. <laughs> no kidding. You know, I should have turned before the bridge. It's very funny. Oh, come here a minute. I want to show you something. That thing still works? Uh-huh. Check this out. Okay, see this building in the harbor? That's where all the boats coming into the colony would have unloaded their cargo. So if the El Dorado treasure came to this island, it would have had to have come through here. Wait a minute, what? What was that? What? Rewind it. Yeah? Wait, stop. Uh-huh. Right there. That's our ticket out of here. Come on. Our ticket out of here? Are you giving up? Maybe you hadn't noticed, but we're kind of outnumbered. <sighs> we're doing fine so far. Oh, Lord. Elena, I don't need your bullet-riddled corpse on my conscience. Let's go. Oh, please. You quit if you want to, but don't use me as an excuse. <laughs> fine. It's me, okay? I am quitting. Are you coming or not? So that's it. You're just gonna forget about the treasure and forget about Drake? <sighs> God damn it, this is not worth dying over. Okay. Okay. Listen, either way, we have to head back to the harbor. Don't worry about it. We can argue about it later. It'll be great. Wait. This time, I drive. Okay. Yeah, now we just gotta find a way in. You know, I read a story once about a cursed Inca treasure. You don't suppose that... 
Please don't tell me you believe in that stuff. I'm just saying. Something bad happened here. The whole colony doesn't just up and vanish. <laughs> yeah. Well, how do you explain it? Looks like that cable would get us up there. Let's go check it out. I'll stay here and keep an eye on our ride. See if you can figure a way to get us to that tower. Okay. Shoot the chain. You've got to get to that tower. I'll meet you back at the customs house. Stand back! <clears throat> All right, let's find a way to the harbor and hope the boat's still there. These must be all the old ship manifests. Oh. Still seem to be in good shape. <sighs> hey, check this out. This looks right. The Esperanza sailed from Cayo, Peru, carrying 800 bars of gold, 1,200 silver emeralds, golden masks, ornaments. Whoa, reading 16th century Spanish? Not just a grave robber after all, huh? Right here. Gold statue. Weight, 20 arrobas. That's over 500 pounds. That's gotta be it. Wow. There you are. That thing kinda gives me the creeps. Huh. That's the last entry. That somebody special? What? Oh. Uh, yeah. Guess you could say that. Huh. I had you pegged as more of a woman in every port kind of guy. <laughs> Don't I wish. No, this was, uh, this was Francis Drake's ring. I, you know, kind of inherited it. Sic parvis magna? Greatness from small beginnings. It was his motto. Check out the date. 29th of January, 1596. One day after he supposedly died. Wait, what are these numbers right here? Coordinates. Right off the coast of Panama. Oh, so that's how you found the coffin. Yeah, that's right. See, Drake left this as a clue to pinpoint the exact burial site. For someone clever enough to figure it out. <laughs> yeah, nice try. But we're still going for that boat. Yeah, I'm afraid this is as close as we're getting to El Dorado. <laughs> 